I know Cuba is one of your little Fox News Republican scare words that means nothing, that you know nothing about, but Cuba is actually doing better than the United States is. For example, they have 90% of their uh, population vaccinated. We don't. They don't have a vaccine mandate. They just understand that vaccines are important for public health and safety and for your own health and safety. So they voluntarily went and got it. And here's the thing. The United States waited so long to help them that they actually developed their own vaccines, which are slightly more effective than the Pfizer vaccine. Uh, as John Cook, John Kirk, excuse me, a uh, professor in Canada said, quote, Cuba is a victim of magical realism. The idea that Cuba, with only 11 million people and limited income, could be a biotech power might be incomprehensible for someone working at Pfizer. But for Cuba, it is possible. And let's see, where's the other quote here? The gamble paid off. This, this is according to The Guardian, by the way. The gamble paid off. This spring, Cuba became the smallest country in the world to successfully develop and produce its own COVID vaccine. They also have universal health care, which we somehow can't afford. But we think of them as some, like, poor country, right? But no, we, we can't afford universal health care. Both their vaccines are over 90% effective, according to Cuban-run clinical trials conducted last spring. They have one of the lowest infection rates of anywhere in the Western Hemisphere. So, yeah. Maybe we should move there.